Alright guys, doodle Doodle screw it and do it here again this time with a good can. I had to shave it off because the clip was bust. Right, first things first of this, is what I see. And like I'm not being like I'm gonna be cool with this, right? I'm gonna be cool with that. I love this is I feel like we're gonna see. That's better that right? <laughs> nah. Scotty G Real Talk. His first podcast is coming up eh, with Darren Arnold. Eh, and they'll be talking about Viv Graham and all that and, and Lee Duffy and things that people won't know. Well, they all have heard of Brian Cockrell and stuff like that, which is always obviously going to be good. This guy's going to set the record straight with a lot of stuff, I think. I'm not sure. Um, I was more into the sort of Essex boys and stuff like that. Didn't know much about Viv Graham or... I knew about Brian Cockrell, but <laughs> I'm sorry, Brian. Um, but uh, when I got your book, I actually ripped it up halfway through. Because <laughs> it was shite. <laughs> <clears throat> Only reason it was shite was because... Uh, it wasn't shady, it was good. Your story's good, but in the book I think she's a ghostwriter because like well I know you're dyslexic me, I'm sorry about this. When you're explaining about a fight. In a book you see he stood up and I stood up and I had, took the stance of say like Muhammad Ali. It started by dancing about like she would have or something, right? Then that way I've got a vision in my head of what's what you're doing. But you know, I got up and I started dancing about like this, and jabbing like this, and I hit him like that. And I'm reading the book, I'm thinking, like what? I don't get it. And then when I go further on, I couldn't help but laugh when he said you took half a pill. I was thinking, and he said you're right. As that 23 stone man. <laughs> Sorry, I'm eating something. 23 stone man took a knee, half a knee. And he was right, I was like, the fuck? I, like, I thought it'd be like, I thought it'd probably take about fucking 15 to 20 to 30 to, to fucking take you, that old big man. No, you're a good guy. I like what you're doing as well with your podcast. You're doing good. I like what you hate bullies. Um, no, I like piss takes, just little piss takes, like jokes. Jokes are banner that people can take. If someone can't take something, I won't do you know? But, aye. So that's good for Scotty. He's got his first podcast coming up. And uh, hopefully good, it will be a good one. Uh, my advice to Scott is, uh, I'm doing A a lot. You do A a lot. When you're asking questions, have the questions all prepared in your head so you don't go, eh, you know, so just, Ask a question with a smile on that. So don't go, eh, hey, don't fill gaps. Gap fillers are called. It's like when I do my raps, I go, oh, motherfucking this. I just swear it's profanity. Because I can't think of another word to put in it or I have to wait for a beat. When you're asking a question and you're thinking of going, eh, hey, just go, if you ever really, you know, you only stay going, if you, eh, hey, don't do that, trust me, I've, I've read about this, so there's a wee bit of advice for you, Scotty. You're yeah, the man. But uh, hope we're going to Newcastle. I was actually, I actually left a comment in Sam Walker's vid last post. Said I was talking to you and I'm fucking going to know what to hear from him, see what he's doing, see if he's training. And I said, I might actually come out Newcastle and help Scotty train. So I do two weeks on, two weeks off. So if the fight's in a few months or something, the next time I'm off work, I, ca I can come down to. Newcastle at one time, <laughs> Newcastle and uh, get some training done, man, because trust me, I've lost three stone, man, and just have not been well. It's been fucking horrible, man. So, I, I can't even imagine lifting weights again, like, so I'm thinking myself, just get back into the MMA and the boxing and that. So, aye, I'd love to come down and, like, fucking just spar you and train you and blah, 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 and do whatever, you know? You would draw a few drug dealers on that. <laughs> joke, joke, joke for YouTube, joke for YouTube, joke for YouTube. Repeat until funny, repeat until funny. No, I'm not gonna. Right. That's basically all I had to say. Um, I think I did have more stuff to say when I was coming on, but I can't remember. But anyway, 
subscribe to my podcast. Not only my podcast, all this. You get people to do podcasts and they yeah, yeah, walk up the street where you're doing this for them and them. And they do those of them, but they do well enough to do a certain topic. Like Fighting Trolls, he does the mental health a lot and jail talk and stuff. And I'm going to go into mental health talk a lot because I've got PTSD and ADHD and uh, per, uh, multiple personality disorder. There's a few things. Trust me, I'm stabbed, slashed, OD, also a car crash stabbing. <laughs> Loads. So, and I've done those, but I don't talk about that. So, yeah, I know a lot about mental health, so I'll be doing something along the lines as well. If you look at the last two videos I've done, I've done a lot of and stuff like that, check them out. A lot of wisdom in them, and there's a bit of a laugh. See, I like to keep things upbeat, you know? Don't move your feet, don't be discreet. You don't know where you're going because you're in the back seat. I'll be rhymes in as well. So, just going to post this and love, use, and leave yous, just like I usually do.